The 10th worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Flow by Hyanon. I actually find this level pretty cool. It's meant to have a nostalgic feel, and that's an explanation for the lack of air decoration. And why they chose the song Serial Madness 2 in the first place. The problem lies in Rob Top's hands when he is the one that gets to decide whether this is epic, feature, great, or nothing at all. Because if this is supposed to feel nostalgic, why would it be epic? Because if it's epic and it was supposed to feel nostalgic, then that could mean that the nostalgia trip has failed. If you create a whole 1.0 level in 2.1 Geometry Dash, then no way is it going to get epic. That's just not it's gonna happen, it's not how it works. So, what you do is, um, the thing is, you create a nostalgic level with 2.1 objects to boot, and Rob Top rates it epic. When it really didn't deserve that if it's trying to be nostalgic, just a feature will do. The problem lies in Rob Top's hands here and not the creator. The ninth worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Electron by Brand Silver. The first thing I'd like to point out is uh, Brand Silver even says in the description, I am happy it got rated, but I don't agree with Epic or First Place. If even Brand Silver doesn't agree with Epic. We start off and the level has a 1.7 background. which started in the Hexagon Force level. Well, Aside from the background, the first part is pretty repetitive with the same design. And now, here, the decoration looks like something from High Life. And considering that that part of High Life was meant to be 1.9 style, then that's not a good sign. This even makes me feel nostalgic right here, and this is even flow. This part is basically the same as the first part, except you're playing as, like, a mini wave and a spider. There's barely any air direct exploration in this part, besides those uh, spinning things, and those don't count. You'll have to spam at the end, but I have no idea what it does, and then you got that last jump. How'd I fail there? The eighth worst epic level in Geology Dash is Sunlit World 2 by Jeffrey Kawai. This level has a modern style to it, and uh, that explains the lack of air decoration, but modern style isn't an excuse for an epic level. And I'm not copying that from Stop Start. <laughs> this part is pretty cool. I don't really like the color combination, but it, it's cool. It, it gets a pass in my book. And this part, I don't know about other people, besides stop start, but I, I like, don't think this is very well at all. The faces just looked out of place, and same with the green clouds. This part's a pretty all right, but none of this level deserves an epic. Some of the level is not too good, some of it's pretty good, and none of it deserves epic. Although Rob Top thinks an excuse to pull off an epic rating with a generic level. It's not how it works, man. The seventh worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Rapid by Burku. Burku's made better than le levels than this. You should check out his most liked level called Through Time. But this isn't Through Time, this is Rapid. Burku's part is honestly the best part. But there's one downside to it. One major downside. You can actually 
literally go through these blocks here and I don't know how you mess that up. You can go pretty far, but you die to Torch's part. So I guess I'll complete it the right way this time. This part has a little air deco and Berku things that can be made up with like dark and background. No, it can't. And Dorf's part it just explodes with color in your face. Decoration of the blocks is alright, but that shape really wasn't necessary. Following up, the 3D isn't even complete on these slabs. What is that? Ew, you just you just put two whole slab counts there. You can use the connector blocks, they're in the editor. You don't have to pay money for them. This last part doesn't include much, but it's alright. Overall, it's an okay level. I wouldn't say epic, but going only to race feels like it kind of too much. But so I'd say it would be in the middle at. The sixth worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Confusion by Shady. I really think this level might have gone for a lemon style because this sure looks like a lemon style. Except the difference is that lemon's actually does it right. Starts off with barely any air decoration, and the air decoration that can be seen is too opaque to really count. It still feels really empty. This part just feels like a lemon drip off with all the design. And here, the lava and the blocks look ugly. And here, the design just is subtly painful. You can't do that. <laughs> and here we've got this techno design. Are they going for a cool level? The fifth worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Nexus by Dorsha. Dorsha is definitely made better than this, because this looks like it came from Geometry Dash World, which makes it look like an early 2.0 level, but it's not. It's 2.1. Maybe it looks like a Geometry Dash World all because of the design that looks like years. Or maybe it's because the Dex Arson songs that are used in every single Geometry Dash World level. We'll never know, but that's my reason. The blocks coming at you just like that is annoying. And those gears in the middle are hard. Then sir, generic build up to the drop here from 2.0. Drop build ups have gotten better in 2.1. But this just takes it all the way back to 2.0 again. <laughs> Everything in this level is the standard 2.0, even though it's 2.1, it's so weird. It really makes you feel 2.0, but it's 2.1. How is this possible? Oh, you are really going that low? Complete.
complaining about these things starting at the sixth one, you know that there's going to be some pretty trash epic rated levels out here. The fourth worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Seizure by Epilepsy Warning. You'll see why I said that in a bit. Starting off, it looks like an unfinished level you, uh, you saw in the Magic Tab. <laughs> and then there's just like too many moving objects. And then color just gets blasted into your face on, well, as if it didn't before, but now it's just going full on. Just kidding, it isn't going full on. It'll get worse later. Well, it's a collaboration between Juffin and Shady. Shady's part is better. And if it weren't for Shady's part, I would have put this at second. But Shady's part saved it from the dreaded runner-up spot. Don't jump when you're hitting these orbs right here. That's just a tip. If you want to make it easier on you, then don't jump there. Juffin's part gets even worse and messier. Gets more objects filled and it's just wacky. Along with all the color in you, it's just really blah. Yeah. Barely a right will do. I mean, these levels aren't, these levels weren't necessarily bad, really, before, like, they were pretty cool, they're, they're nice, but this one is just, I, I have to say, this level is actually bad. Good job. Good job, Jaffin, this level is actually bad. Chompy thing. And the le the level's done. <laughs> Wistful Wish by Juffin and Shady. Does it deserve uh, an epic? No. Does it deserve a feature? No. Does it deserve a rate? <sighs> The third worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Lunar Abyss by Frost. In the description, it says it's a 2.0 to 2.1 level, but most of the decoration looks like it was 1.9. Who knows? Maybe Frost made all of this in 2.1 and wanted to make it look like it was a 2.0 to 2.1 level by making the first 2.0 parts have only things that were available in the 2.1 editor and 2.0 editor. And the 2.1 part which is basically all of them. For like being badly decorated, it's pretty fun. And for that, I would give it a rate. But this is no ordinary Saint Eight Star. This is the hardest level on the list and as hard as a medium demon like very or insanity. Still haven't been either of those though. The hardest part of the level, I'd say it's, well, the hardest part of the level is a certain 1% and it's 83. <laughs> Just like that, the level ends. For the good gameplay, 
I would say it's a rate, but definitely didn't deserve epic. The second worst epic level in Geometry Dash is Post Cannon by Subwoofer. Sorry, Subwoofer, but this level is trash for an epic level. I mean, like, the use of the move trigger is pretty cool, but the decoration is lacking, uh, and the black, uh, the black outline is ugly. Not trying to be racist, by the way. just give it a rate in my book yeah that would just be a rate the worst epic level in geometry dash is color dance by underings hyena done and wolfie said wolf this first part is underings part and the decoration is pretty cool background is lacking decoration, but the walk is not cool. The lack of decoration problem is taken care of with Hyena's part, because every part, every part of the background is taken out by block. This is what we said Wolf's part. And it's bad for 1.9 standards. It looks alright again, and that's because we're back at Undrace's part. Wolf. Wolfie said wolf. Stars requested six. Ha <laughs> ha. 